Facebook, YouTube. Today I want to make a statement, you know, concerning a true servant of God. And a true servant of God is all about simply like, you know, John JFK kind of put it, you know. He says, you know, but I'm going to show you the spiritual remix. It's not for what Jesus, for what God and Jesus can do for me because they already done so much for us. But being a true servant is all about what I can do for them. You know, you're focusing on what I can do for them. And of course, you know, you're supposed to be on Romans 12, 1 and 2 mode, you know, presenting your body as a living sacrifice, holy and acceptable, you know, and pleasing unto, you know, God, you know. You know, and that's what, you know, what do, that procedure of Romans 12 and 1 and 2 will develop you to become a true servant of God because you're focusing on proving what is good and what is acceptable and perfect will of God. You're not trying to prove anything to nobody else, you know, or to the world and conform to it. You're just trying to transform. And the thing is, a true servant of God, of course, you know, Jesus showed the ultimate sacrifice of being a true servant of God. You know, giving his whole self, his, whole, his life, giving his whole life away, you know, for the sake of humanity's salvation. And if we're not with that kind of, uh, if we're not driven to desire to do that, then that indicates that we're not learning how to be a true servant. You know what I'm saying? Because you're focusing on what, you know, I can do for someone else. How much I can shine forth the love of God to some, for whosoever. You know, it's focus on shining a light. To lead, not to get, gain attention to yourself, but to draw people as an example to the way of righteousness. Is what a true servant of God is all about. It's not about, you know, popularity. It's not about, you know, being whatever that glorifies your flesh. I mean, if your flesh is being glorified in certain things, you know, you better question, you know, what things are, you know, question what's going on. Because this is not about, you know, flesh being glorified. It's about the spirit. It's about drawing people to the way, the truth, and the life, Jesus Christ to the righteous path, you know, and leading them there, you know, and and getting them to the promised land concerning to heaven, to be with their creator, their father in, in heaven, you know, Jehovah God. And that's the whole, and, and, and of course, you know, focus on being each and every day, being in the image, seeking to be in the image and the likeness of God, you know, fulfilling the purpose of the creation of humanity. That's what a true servant of God is all about. So I hope and pray that you are striving to be a true servant of God and not trying to see what you can get out from other people concerning your flesh. Okay? To God be the glory, to Him forever and ever. In Jesus' name, amen. Be a true servant of God.